Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT. Tying on my idea, explosive one. Jonas, I'm the man on the sticks. You have the sticks. And we're playing Red Dead Redemption 2 Ham Sandwich. And ham Sandwich. I saw the pig, all right? That was, all right. That was affected. I oh. like pig. Madam, pardon me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Wow. Hey, look. Lady. You know what else would make me excused? If you hit that subscribe button, ring that dang that bell. And you Whoa, what are they doing too? over there? I think I'm supposed to be on that side of the fence. Oh, shit. I hate when I'm on the wrong side of the fence. Okay, all right, all right. Let's let's go over here. <laughs> what took you so long? Oh, good lord! I was just beginning to enjoy some peace. Why are you quiet. so close, dude? <laughs> Asked that first barman I met, and he told me Charles was here. <laughs> Not one of life's great mysteries, it turns out. <laughs> all right, so we are looking for a large Native American fellow who is a boxer. I'm leaving now. I guess this is him. Nice hair. Don't know the half of it. He doesn't have on a shirt. You're, you're, <gasps> I'm alive. <laughs> so are you. <sighs> So's he. That's uncle? What, what are you fuck? doing? I don't know. It's our buddy. I'm alive. Uncle oh, shit. maybe he was in some sort of trouble. Kind of, kind of just. It's Charles. I don't know. I'm oh, like one of the ones from the tribe we were helping with, Arthur. No, it's Charles, the guy we took like on that? missions with us. Of course not. Charles died so, a hundred so. times. Oh, yeah. I mean, no That's right, that Come guy. On. Man, I thought you were dead. Sure. Abigail's still alive, too, only she left me. Uh, excuse me. I'd like to place a bet. On who? On myself, to win. Lone Wolf. How much? All of this. Okay. Funny thing, I pegged you for the favorite, but the odds just got real good. What about you, sir? A uh, little wager on the wolf here? Real redskin brave. What? Holy shit. I'm sorry. Bet against Charles. Charles used to die all the time. It'd be hard not to bet against him. <laughs> Should I bet against Charles? He's kind of a puss, man. I'm betting on Charles. Sure, Fuck you, Jonas. Me. He's our friend. And we don't turn our backs on friends. We don't ever turn our backs that's on not friends. The, that's not the desperado way. The descendant of ancient not. warriors and a not so noble savage. On my that is left, just a ferocious battler from the valleys, Simon of Wales. And on my right. An Indian Hercules. I'm sorry, excuse me? Savage, the untamable. What? The unbeaten, and dare I say unbeatable, lone wolf. You know how this works. No weapons, no forfeiting, no crying like a beaten child. Everything else goes. You win by knockout, you win by retirement, or you win by death. Okay, Let's have a well. good fight, boys. Let's keep it clean. This is barbaric so and racist. <laughs> what does it say? Focus. Focus on Charles by holding left trigger to cheer or boo. So just watching Charles fight a man in the fucking alley? Yeah, basically. God, it's like Fight Club. Pretend he's Micah. Pretend he's Micah. Come on, Charles. There you go, Charles. Oh, Charlie in the chocolate jaw. Charlie in the fucking red. Oh, oh he's kicked in the face. <laughs> Good shit. Jesus Christ, man. That's what he's doing for work now? I mean, oh, if you got it in you. I guess so. Hey, Lone Wolf. Whoa. How? Made my months, but you also made some fellas mighty unhappy. <laughs> so it goes. Here's your share, partner. We just made the bed. I said we So you keen on staying around here or heading off with me and Uncle? But, John, I haven't seen you two in years. I know. But right now, my sense is you just need to lie low. Where? We got a little place up past Blackwater in the high country. Okay. I gotta grab my baggage. I booked a steamer heading upriver. That's why I was pretending to throw the fight. Okay, boys. 
I'll meet you at the bridge outside Saint Denis. What are you doing? Oh, just have a few urns of room. <laughs> You're useless. I am a deep thinker. Be quick. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Fucking uncle, dude. Comic relief. 40 bucks? Yeah, Which it way? was worth it. Uh, my bag's on the dock side. Yo. So, what happened? You mean... What the Arthur fuck? Look me. at this dog. We yeah. <laughs> Why does everything I look fucked up out. now? Dude, something's wrong with the game. Went back for the money. You, everything's all spotted you know and weird. Arthur, sure. It's like <laughs> well, got to me up north, so I went it's like umbrellas taking over this town. I had to Oh run. shit. He buried Arthur. If any of us had been found, we'd have oh, of course. I understand. He's where he would have wanted to be. A pretty hillside facing the evening sun. Oh, he shit. gave me his satchel with some of his things in it. Remember that journal he always drew in? I got it. I'm a bit of a draftsman myself nowadays. A bit. He was a good man. As much as any of us could be. Getting sick like that has to rattle a fella. Uh, rattle him or, or give him some kind of understanding. Oh, really all about. Hey, yeah. I miss Arthur. Do you that miss Arthur? Sense. I do. Anyway, Damn, Arthur. I you You'll be missed. Forever. And me, the same about you. Dutch? Who knows? Dead? Maybe? I'm not sure. Dutch ain't heard dead. All kind no, of things, he ain't but dead. One thing I know, he ain't around here. I ain't heard nothing real in years since, well, that time. Nor me. Micah. I hope that bastard's dead. You know, he was the one speaking to them agents. What? Putting them on us the whole time. Or since before I got off Sisica. They picked up Strauss. The agents. Made a real mess of him. I heard he died in custody. Wow. Never said a word. <sighs> Guess some folk is strong in ways you can't see. Everything that happened. All those deaths. Micah? None of us is innocent in that. Dutch, least of all. But I don't think we would have had to make those calls. All that mayhem. Okay. Uh, hold on. What? Careful. Why? Uh oh. Those are Guido Martelli's men. Uh, what does that mean? He. Yeah, I didn't know what that means either. And that's, that sounds Bronte. racist. <laughs> Been here an hour. Hey. Guido Martelli. His real name could be that. <laughs> I don't know. Come over here. What now? Well, you go left, I go right. On three. Mm -hmm. Three. <laughs> okay. You didn't fuck with the wrong guy, just so you know. Yeah, Guido Martelli. Evidently. Why is Charles the worst? Who are you telling? Those guns that Let's go. There's a wagon up there. I'll sure. get my bag. Okay. <gasps> There's a chest here, Jones. Come on, John. What am I driving? I don't want to drive. What if I don't want to drive? <laughs> you can't drive 55. Do I get to drive? Or are you driving? You're driving. Right. Hallelujah. Uh, I don't have any other guns. Fuck. All right. Well, Where I we guess we're rocking this. Over the bridge going out of town. <laughs> oh, damn, dude. You really are fucking showing people how to <laughs> kill. I didn't want to do it. You see any law? Not yet. Keep your eye out. San Denis ain't short on police. I remember that. Fucking oh, so Sandini always wants you Anyone? to get killed. Good so far. So now I gotta kill more officers. Shots, better chance we have. Of you the always have to kill least. everyone in Saint Denis, no. or they have we to kill you, caught. or you don't Martelli do anything, the and they all want to kill pocket. you anyway. If they take oh, yeah. us in. We won't get out of the room. I don't want to get the shit out of this. That's not the man I try to be anymore. No, I don't want that either. You see anything? Nothing. Hey, we made it out. If I Ooh. ever want to go back, remind me that I hate Saint Denis. Is that suitcase gonna fall over? Yep. There it went. Give me some simple folk <laughs> and wide open spaces. Now you got a Speaking wagon. Simple. <laughs> oh, well, great. Wait, that suitcase stood back up on its own. <laughs> yep, there it goes. You boys been all getting up to no good? Kind of. Been getting we'll, shot. we'll watch the suitcase for the rest of the well, ride. I know, right? Very good I, well, it's magic. Come it on, fell over and stood itself <laughs> back up. 
<laughs> All right, what's going on? Am I driving? You're driving? <laughs> I'm not driving. No one's driving. Can we drive it a little yeah, faster? Yeah, can we fucking watch a goddamn wagon with a suitcase in the back for longer, please? <laughs> Like, that went on, like, two minutes longer than it needed to. I mean, they were talking to each other. We had to meet back up with Uncle and mm -hmm. some exposition. I know you don't like it, Jonas. You know, every time I hear Uncle, I think of uh, next Friday where he called uh, his Uncle Unk and, like, the Uncle and that, and he was Who's, all like... You mean Friday after next? Friday after... No, next Friday, I mean. Next Friday. Where he goes and he lives with his uncle and he calls him Unk. Your Uncle Elroy? Uncle Elroy. Your Uncle Elroy. I'm your Uncle Elroy. <laughs> F.O. Sachi. <laughs> F.O. Sachi. All right, so we got a fucking look, man. We got... This place is getting together, man. Yeah, Are you fucking kidding me? Look, I got a fast travel map here. Oh, is this a plate of fucking food? I'm starvacious. I cannot down, eat right? it. Do I have to sit to eat? No, I don't think so. Wait, maybe I do. Oh yeah, wait a minute, Jonas. You might be right. <laughs> no, you just no, you just sit down, <laughs> stare at it, and pretend out, pretend to how hungry you aren't. What is that, Jonas? Looks like it's got some pot Gruel? potatoes and carrots in it and beef. Oh yeah, a little and bit of a meat. little beef stew. All right, can't eat it though. That's, oh God, no! That's forbidden. This is God, my, no! You can't eat it. That's where I can change my clothes. This is where I can craft and cook stuff. Let me see if I can cook something real quick, Jones, because I'm starving. I like to do this shit off camera, but you know what happens when you? All right, let's see. What can I make? Nothing because I have no meat. Well, unfortunate. Unluckers. I guess we can at least get the next mission started here. We might be able to get through about half of it. Okay. And here's our buddies. Oh wait, yeah, there's Ulysses ah, and there's somebody feels else. Feels like old times. <laughs> Probably a Sadie. Good Adler. to have the old gang back together again. Let's just hope things don't turn out like last time. Here he goes. What I tell you, Charles? Boy is as sour as weak old milk. No wonder she didn't stay with you. Not even a retired two dollar whore would stay with you. That's wow. the goddamn truth. Now you used to be decent company, but now you're worse than a snake with a toothache. All he does is whine, whine, whine. Excuse me. Oh, don't get all angry. It ain't gonna change nothing. You're hopeless. And I mean that literally. You got no hope. I mean, look at you. Look at this place. Your dream home. I've had better than <laughs> your dream, dream home, all right. Oh, darling Abigail. I've changed. Come live with me in an outhouse. I wouldn't ask my worst enemy to take a shit in. What are you wow. It's Unk is fucking <laughs> tripping. It's a dump. Yeah, you sound like it is. It's gotta go. Get some self-respect, you miserable sack of shit. Build a house a lady set foot in. The place just needs a woman's touch. It needs leveling. No woman would touch this place. Now, I reckon these horses can have it down in a minute. Here. Come on, tie that end around the horses. You loop that end around. Oh, they're just gonna tear it down and start it over. So wait, why? The, why wouldn't you just wait? Why wouldn't you just start a new house and leave that one up? Because right now it's shelter. Let's get going. And then start a house. Is it really shelter though? You got this, John. I'll go when you do. Okay. On me. I need a break. I need a break. Down on the left stick and then tap oh, don't A. Get sentimental. Level it. Oh, here we go. You gotta tap that shit. Dude, why are you breaking your house? I don't like it. <laughs> because it's a, it's a shed. Dude. Yeah, but at least it like provided like shelter from rain and wind. And fuck that thing. See? That's what you I bought. You, wouldn't yeah, be no not anymore. Trouble. And now. Now we head into town, buy ourselves a house right out of a book. Same as if it were a bicycle. Where in town? There's a fella by the train store. Cakes hardwood and timber. Okay, you keep working here. But if I don't go with you, who's going to tell you that? Just need a bit of peace and quiet from your incessant yapping. Charles, I disagree with what they just did. Whip him if you have to. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Holy shit. Yo, we, we tore the house now. Oh, look at that. I'm out of fucking Stam Jones. I don't have anything to eat. 
Oh, I can drink this fine brandy. Give me a little bit of energy. What else do I have? I've got nothing. I need, oh, there was something. Oh, I guess I'll drink a little bit more. Let's just get drunk, I guess, you know? Yeah, fuck it. When, when you get tired, just have a couple drinks and you'll be fine, right? Yeah, then your stamina goes back okay. up. Yeah, seems about right. I got to well feed done. the horse, too. I, I really do. My horse is... Okay, yeah, yeah, good girl. Great, great, great. All right, come on. Uh, I don't have anything to feed the horse. Jonas, can't the horse just graze off the land? Isn't it? I would, I would think he could just graze off the land. Isn't it? Yes. Isn't all of this horse food? Look at all this food. Eat the food. Like he could eat anything. I would guess. Exactly. I guess horses and deer and shit. They eat like. You eat a man. That, well, <laughs> she. Oh, here she comes. <laughs> Watch out, boy! She'll chew you up. Oh, here she comes. It's a man-eater. Very good. Now, oh, what are they doing? There's a crazy oh, there, girl. Thing. What is this guy being chased by something? Should I help him? Oh, shit. Please! Jonas! Oh, my Jonas, it's on me! <laughs> You jumped off the horse and it was like, oh, you fucked this world. Because I was scared, uh, Oh, my God, you're almost dead. Fucking Jaguar. I was scared. Dude, I know you're scared. It's okay. I'm definitely scared. Skin that bitch. This will give me some meat, man. I need the meat. Hell yeah, it will. And I might even be able to sell the pelt for money when I get into Blackwater. Good luck with it. <laughs> Cougar fang. Hell yeah. There's cougars out here? Give me this fucking pelt. Put it on the horse. Poor cougar. Poor, poor cougar pet. Poor cougar pelt. And give me this cougar meat. Oh, Jones, there's like fucking scratch marks all on my back. And not the kind I like. You're carrying this back, girl. <laughs> okay, then. Thanks. My hat's on the ground. God damn. Look at the fucking claw marks. Jones, did you hear that apparently yeah, in, uh, this actually happened in, uh, LA or San Francisco? Uh huh. Where, or California, somewhere in California, where a guy got attacked by a mountain lion, like in the street, because it's like, that's prime area for them, honestly. And they do actually, like, roam the streets in some cases. There's oh, like, because they, like, wander down from, like, the yeah. fucking hills? Yeah. No, I didn't fucking So a guy, it. like, fought a mountain lion with his bare hands, choked it, and killed it. <laughs> oh, my God. In the street? Yeah, Holy dude. Holy shit, dude. Lived, lived to tell the freaking tale. I'd be scared. Rightfully so, my man. Rightfully freaking so. I would definitely be scared. Oops. <laughs> Just destroyed your fence. Sorry about that, folks. What are you tripping about, horses? I mean, those are obviously cows. All right. Uh, oh, well, this part of your fence is broken, so I'll just take this as my opportunity to escape your territory. But, yeah, man, that's a man's man right there. Because if I was attacked by a mountain lion, I can almost guarantee you that would be the end of me. I don't know how to fight no mountain lion. Uh, Yeah. Like, those things are vicious creatures. I think it's crazy how, like, domesticated versions of cats are, like, fine. But, like, non-domesticated cats will fucking tear your face off? Yeah, man. Like, cats are, like, really, really vicious animals. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, like, I was talking about this today. Like, domesticated cats are fine, but if, like, you took a cat into the woods and left it there, it would turn into, like, a vicious monster because it would be fighting for everything. Or, like, feral cats, even. Domesticated yeah. cats that are feral. Yeah, man. Like, they're no joke. I need the meat. You can have the pelt and you can have the animal. Two dollars. <gasps> I'm up to 400, though. Oh, shit. Right. Look at my red ass horse. So when your horse gets a red ass like that, uh -huh. you gotta pet, you gotta brush them to oh, really? unredden its butt cheeks. Even though I'm just scrubbing its neck. 
No, so you yeah. scrub its neck and then its, be- its butt turns not yeah, red. See, no, it doesn't have a red ass anymore. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that doesn't know how it works for you. Somebody strokes you and then you're not red. Uh, yeah. Isn't that yes. How? I mean, sometimes. When's the last time you got a good stroke in? Got a good stroke in? <laughs> yeah. And I, you ever heard that song Stroking by Clarence Carter? Absolutely not. I fucking not. love that song. I don't even so know. So, like, I remember say. being like a little boy in here and I'd be like, I don't get what he means. And then I did. I've been stroking. <laughs> that That's song? what I be doing. That's the song you're talking about? Yeah, Stroking to the yeah, East. That really song. Yeah. Uh, Clarence Cotter, Clarence Cotter, Clarence Cotter, Clarence Cotter. Ooh, oh, shit. John. Clarence Cotter. <laughs> Come sit down. <laughs> Sure. I don't know if I know that. You, no. uh, that's part of the you song. Got any work? Yeah. I mean, there's always work. Whole country's getting robbed, robbing, or stopping robbers. Well, seems like there ain't much else in this world except oh, bastards, shit. victims of bastards, and the bastards who want to put the bastards in the ground. And which okay. are you exactly? Me? In my time, all three. But same as most people. I guess. Hmm. Funny thing. About this job, well, opportunity. I just might get to be all three again. Oh shit! How you mean? <clears throat> you ever heard of uh, Shane Finley? Cattle wrestler, murderer, thief, child killer. Wow! He's wanted in five states. God damn. I caught him last week. He was disguised as a lady in a house for fallen <laughs> women. I was bringing him in, and I got robbed. By a professional rival of mine, James Langton. Oh, he's a nasty bastard. I didn't much like him even before he robbed me. That happened a lot. This line of work. Yeah, but they're all people like me. Anyway, now they're holed up in the desert down south, waiting to head north so they can hand them in to the state troopers in the north country. I'd given up on the job as just a bad lot, but now that you're here, Maybe we can go rob him back. Is the money good? Yeah. It's real good. Plus, I don't much like getting robbed by no one. Come on. Where is it we're heading again, you say? Mm. South. Now, come on. Mount up. We got was she insinuating that she of was in a whorehouse when she got robbed? Oh, look, the, the horse is, it's not as bad. It's, yeah, I don't know. It's clearing up a little we'll bit. We'll say yes, she was in the whorehouse. I kind of get that, uh, good that she may be, you know. Well, she's such a wild card, man. I wouldn't say anything about her that may not be po- positive or true. <laughs> Are you telling me I should be afraid of the video game woman? <laughs> in real life, yes. Some she's going to come and get ranches, you. Some buy horses. Horses are cheaper. He looks mean. He is. Hmm. <laughs> oh, she got a mean horse. Hmm. Probably a war horse. My ranch? It's something else, you know. It is not something you gotta else. gotta come up there. He ain't had any trouble. Some squatters, but that's it for the most part. That's good. Maybe these fellers I heard about have stayed north or gone off somewhere else or dropped down dead in their own tracks. It's good country. All country is good. It's just folk that are bad. You know who I got up there with me? Uncle. Uncle. God's uncle. Abigail? Uh, Abigail ain't come there just That's yet. That's a different story really? right there. <laughs> you er, want to talk about it? Well, Aww. maybe, but Charles Smith. We found Charles Smith. Charles, I know him. Charles? Yep. He's alive? Chucky. Yeah. He's doing... Okay. He was prize fighting in Saint Denis. Weren't seeming too well. He took everything real hard. But I think life on the plains is gonna be good for him. Prize fighting. I always like Charles. You life send him on my best. Plains. I will. You know you can come along too. Build a cabin on the land. I've done that all before. Can't do it again. I'm on my own now, John. I- I ain't so good with people. Uh, the offer's there, whenever you want it. That's kind. Unlikely to be taken up, but kind. You heard Aww. anything of Dutch? Nothing. You? No. 
You'd think. He's a colorful character. Word would get out. That's one way of putting it. Look, what happened with the gang changed everyone who was a part of it. The Dutch who put a blanket round me after the O'Driscolls. O'Driscolls. the same man at Beaver Hollow. And Beaver now, Hollow? he might not be so colorful no more. You see a man whose character changed. I see a man who got found out for who he truly was. Mm. We was fools to follow him. Mm. I was a fool and I paid for it. And I was one of the lucky ones. He tried to kill him. Fucking Dutch. Micah being a I narc. Following Dutch for too long, but I blame Micah for most everything else. Damn right. He's out there. And someday, I hope we'll find him. But not now. Come on. Maybe I get to kill Micah as John Martian. Do you fight? Did you? Was there Micah, a guy you came in contact with in Red Dead Redemption? Uh, I don't remember honestly. That was a long time ago. Yeah, dude, that game came out way, way long ago. But I did play the shit out of it, but I don't remember. I couldn't even tell you what like the gameplay uh, arc was or like the the cycle. I don't know if there was hunting in it There's honestly. There's a spot up ahead where we can see over most of the country. They'll be down there. So, okay. James Langton, the bounty hunter. He's got this outlaw you captured in a women's boarding house? Shane Finley. Oh, it wasn't a whorehouse. It was a boarding have house. We to give him back to us before he rides north with him to hand him over to some state troopers? Correct again. Though the giving back part is optimistic. I'm forever the optimist. A woman's a boarding house, so she's not... Sorry, Sade. <laughs> Maybe you should keep your fucking contagious looking horse over there to yourself. <laughs> you can give me horse disease. This that is horse does look fucked up. It's dude. It does, dude. Right. It's inside out. Like the Pixar movie. <laughs> I heard that was a really good movie. I've never seen it, though. I don't watch many cartoons. Come on. Yeah, Let's grow up, a Jonas. Watch the cartoons with us. I will. You watched Spider Verse. I did. That was good. Equip binoculars. I know how to do that. You do it like this. Be quicker if we both look. You got binoculars, don't you? Yeah, chick. Of course I got binoculars. What am I looking for, though? I think I see something. Yup. There I? they are. Down there. Who's who? Well, the bad I don't see. Oh, the there they are. All tied up. <laughs> Very funny. And that big fat fella with the funny hat, that's James Langton. The other fellas just work for him. Where do you think they're heading? I don't know. Come on. Let's mm -hmm. go follow them. Get them. All right. Look, you take your weird horse, and I'm going to take my real horse Looks here. Looks like they're cutting through the canyon underneath us. Let's go. All right, Sadie, how do we get there? Don't tell me I'm going down there. No? Oh, we're just going to follow the treacherous uh, path alongside the edge of the... I would be so uncomfortable with this. I know. I would for sure, too. They'll I, mean, be coming through here. I don't like heights that are unsecured. Like, I don't mind heights as long as I'm secured. Like, walking on, like, a plank really high. I don't like that. Mmm. I was watching something on Reddit where this lady was climbing like one of those rock climbing walls that they have in gyms and shit. Yeah. She falls and like snaps her arm, dude. It sucks. Oh, dude. It sucks. You heard the snap and everything. It's it like sucked. snap, crackle, and pop. Whoa. Yeah, dude. It hurt to watch. It I was, bet. It was a what could go yeah. wrong, too, so you never really know. Those are basically 50 50s. Oh, like it could be something yeah, like it, silly. Like. Yeah. Like, oh, this guy fell and, you know. His soda spilled on his neck. Yeah, his you dog no licked his face. Here? Or it could be what like, are you doing, huh? I snapped my arm. <laughs> you talking to me or Langton? Sorry, I ain't used to having anyone with me. So are you just talking to yourself, lady? That's kind of weird. My guess is they'll stop up ahead. We can get a better look at them. You know his thinking pretty well. Hmm? If you can't outgun them, you gotta outthink them. 
Oh my god. I don't want to be this close to the edge, Sadie. I know, right? Holy shit, dude. Just got you fucking Lincoln Park in it. I wouldn't want to drive. Step closer to the edge, and he's about to break. Oh, I get it, Jonas. That's a the Lincoln, Lincoln Park meme. Yeah. It's their lyrics. Yep. Because you owned all their albums. Oh, I never listened to one of them. But you knew the song. It was on the radio for 90 years. I call bullshit because okay, you know all their horse. music. I it's do every song. Trance. I cried when he died. <laughs> oh, my God. He did die, didn't he? Yeah, he killed himself. What do I got here? Do I have a repeater, bolt-action rifle, Lancaster? Yeah, they're stopping. And that sure is Shane Finley coming off the back of his horse. What are they waiting for? Uh, the rest of Langton's men, I think. <laughs> Langton's doing pretty well for himself. How come he's got all them men and you work alone? <laughs> I got you. You're worth ten of them. <sighs> Great. All right, so what you think? Should we threaten them? Start shooting at him or sneak down and pick him off one by one. Oh. I reckon sneaking down is our best opportunity, but uh, it's your call. But I was in my call. Yeah, because you're the person who's in charge, I guess. All right, let, let's sneak on him. I'll then. follow your lead. Let's sneak down there. Okay, well, follow away. But we'll do that next episode. All right. That is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. While you're at it, laddie friends, thumb the watches too. But for Jonas, for D&D Dynamite, we are out. Oh. Oh.